Glasgow Chamber of Commerce has created a partnership with the Manhattan Chambers and they did a trip last year in September, eh, November and it was to take some businesses from Scotland who are interested in doing business with businesses in Manhattan. If you think of, even if in the last, what, three weeks we've been in New Jersey, we've been in Manhattan, we've been in Orlando and we've been in Tampa because we've been out developing relationships with our key clients. I think it's really encouraging that the Glasgow Chambers do this because they see that the membership, we're Platinum Partners, and they see that the membership want to engage with internationalisation. And we have been working internationally now for, what, four years, five years. Um, it's such an opportunity. We are a boutique firm, but that's where we're really agile. We can make quick decisions we can move strategies based on what our clients need. We can, at the drop of a hat, be seven hours and we're in Manhattan. This is just perfect when you fall down the stairs. Three weeks ago we were in Times Square, now we're in George Square. We're it bringing Glasgow to Manhattan and Manhattan to Glasgow. Yeah. We've just met up with Jessica Walker. So when Jessica, you see this show, it was fantastic to meet you. Really super excited to come out and see you, hang out in Manhattan in a few, in a few months time. And it was great to hear all about WeWork and how you're moving in on the 1st of July and we hope to come over, do some presentations uh, across the WeWork network and uh, look forward to coming over and visiting in Manhattan. Brilliant, so from Times Square to George Square, that could be our two and it's sunny locations. behind us, or behind Richie, it's sunny because Jessica said it's always Beautiful. sunny in Glasgow. It so. is always sunny in Glasgow. Um, anyway, that was good, really enjoyed yeah. that. Right, let's get let's get. Many of you will know Carol from her days as a TV presenter. Uh, what you might not know is Carol set up her own business a few years ago. Uh, the business is called Diary Doll. Carol, why don't you start your own business? I'm a very I'm, I'm the kind of person that likes to push myself and I, I like being outside my comfort zone because I think it's a boring life if you just stick with what you know. Can I sit down? You taught him everything he knows and you're, let's face it, you're the fastest of us all, man. Yeah. 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 yeah.